Hello everybody and welcome back to this short little tutorial. I wanted to just quickly go over how you now download and install the FlybyWire A320NX modification for Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. To do so, all you gotta do is go to flybywiresim.com. Link will be in the description down below. What you do is you go up here and you select downloads. Once you select the downloads, you'll select the A32NX. What you're gonna see here is a couple options. You have option one and option two. Option one is an installer, a brand new installer, which I'll show you guys here momentarily, and then a manual installation. Uh, if you want to do the manual installation version, watch the first video I made about how to install the A320 uh, NX mod. In this option, we're gonna actually show you how to use the installer. So go ahead and select download the installer. Once you've done that, you're gonna get this file right here, the setup.exe file, and we're gonna go ahead and run it. Now you'll probably get this up if you have Windows uh, turned on for your Windows Microsoft Defender. All you have to do is select more info and run anyway. Of course, don't do this on any software. Always be sure you can trust the software you're doing that on. What's gonna happen now is it's actually going to install the FlybyWire installer. It is its own little piece of software. What you'll see here is a couple options. First off, you'll notice you have the A3 80x option here which tells you that the, of course they are working on the a320x a380x and we have the a32nx and this looks says not installed as you can see it gives you a version history gives you variants because right now we just have the leap 1a but they plan on adding a different a couple different engine types for you you get the options of selecting the development or the experimental versions as well and you can install each one of them whichever you prefer for me, I'll just use the staple for now. So what I'll do is I'll go down, I'm gonna bring up my settings real fast and make sure that my install directory is the correct directory. It is the correct directory. I already know this. Be sure to make sure that this is actually set properly, that you have the correct uh, install directory selected here. We'll go back to A320NX. And what we'll do is select update. All this is gonna do is gonna automatically download the folder and then install it into that directory. It's basically making it a hands-off approach versus the hands-on approach as the manual installation. So we'll let this finish up here. Now we'll move to a second step here of decompressing. What that is, is basically just like unzipping the file, just like you do during the manual installation. And now as you see, it says completed. It has now been installed, and that is it. That is it. You have now installed the A320NX uh, FlyBowire mod for your Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Of course, if you have any questions about it or any issues, feel free to leave a comment down below. I'll help in the best way that I can. Obviously, I am not a developer or associated with FlybyWire, but I appreciate all of what they're doing for the community, especially with Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. So thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. Are you a fan of the A320NX mod? And are you looking forward to the A380X? I know I am. All right, thanks for watching, guys. If you're going to subscribe, hit the not put a bell notification icon. Don't forget, you can support me over at patreon.com slash mnflyclub. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time up in the sky.